hey guys, do me a favor. I'm going to just wait a minute or two until some people get in here because it's not going to be a super, it's not going to be a super long stream. So maybe you can um, share the video, tell everybody to hop over here for a few minutes and, uh, and then we'll just do a little bit up here. This is a piece I'm working on for somebody. I don't have any microphone hooked up either, so I'm sure you guys can hear me, but um, there might be a little bit of uh, like echo in the background or whatever. But I just wanted to talk to you guys for a few minutes and maybe work on this for a minute also. Uh, let me look at some stuff here while I'm waiting. Okay, glitter. Okay, so the glitter inspired somebody to do a painting. That's awesome. All right. Oh, I'm, I'm somebody's favorite artist. I never would have thought that in a million years. Thank you, by the way. Jessica's watching us from work. Thank you. Awesome. Let's see here. So if you guys can just do like a quick share of this real quick, go, you know, somewhere. Once it builds up and get some people in here, I'll uh, I'll start doing a little bit of this and talking. Now I don't have too long though today, so let's try to hurry up and get some people in here. A lot of nice things. You guys are awesome, man. It makes it so worth it. Um, how do I get a shirt? You can go to my website. I don't know if they're sold out. Every time I put something up there on my website, it gets sold out, and then I have a problem. Then I have a problem uh, retrieving, retrieving new products. I, I'm like doing multitasking. I'm, I'm not good at that. Thank you for watching. Never comment, but always watch. Awesome. All right, come on. Let's get some more people up in here. Get some more people in here. So, yeah, I'll just wait a minute. Website. Well, there's three of them. They all go to the same one. Uh, uh, paintingsbyjustin.com. Then there's thepowerofpainting.com. And then the third one is savedbypainting.com. So you can get to the same website from all of those places. All right, France. Oh, that's it. You know what? Everybody do me one favor. There's only 42 people in here, so I, I want to wait until it builds up. Tell me where are you watching from. That is one of my favorite things, I must say, is when I'm, when I'm doing this and I'm reading where everybody's from. It just blows my mind away. So go ahead and do that real quick. <clears throat> Tell me where you're from. All right, we got New York in the house, Texas. Michigan, Tennessee, Biloxi, Mississippi, Maryland, Arizona, Idaho, Georgia, Washington State, Kansas City, Genio. Is that how, did I pronounce that right? G E N I O. Very bad at spelling stuff. Florida, New Mexico, Ireland, Canada. Awesome. Southern California. Iceland. Oh man, I want to go to Iceland. Arizona. We got people from all over the place. Connecticut. Argentina. Pennsylvania, right over the bridge from where I'm at. California. Definitely love California. I, I think the first, I think the very first workshop that I'm going to do this year out of state is going to be California. I've always liked California and I want to go there. I'm probably going to do like a three day thing there. So I'll have to let everybody know when I'm doing that because it's, it's definitely something I want to do. Maybe near like Disneyland or something like that. 
inspired me so many ways through your paintings. That is just so cool, man. Amazing to hear that. Texas Panhandle. Shading of the Heart, fine art and design. I will be there. Awesome. Awesome. It's funny because I wish I could turn my volume up right now to show so you guys can hear how many times my phone's dinging. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I'll mention this a little bit later on too, but so if anybody knows me, they know that I'm like somebody who, well, let me just make sure my framing is, is correct here. So anybody who knows me, they, they would know that, that I'm somebody who genuinely cares about you, right? And that's just me. I've always been like that. I really care about the, the other person, okay? On the other end, the people that I meet, I genuinely care. So let me just give you an example. I'm going to use Facebook for an example. So I think right now, um, so when I started my Facebook page, it started growing and everything was great and a lot of people were interacting. And right now, I'm somewhere in between 25 and 30,000 people on Facebook. When I put a picture up, it only shows it to like 2% of the people that like my page. So that kind of sucks if you really think about that. It really sucks. 2%. So Instagram is sort of the same thing. What, what, what my point is, is they're like taking the reach away from people like me. And I want to reach more people, not less. So here's what I did. I, and I'll mention this a little bit before we end it too. And I'll put the information in. So I just started throwing my number up on my Facebook page, like the, the picture, the, uh, the background picture, whatever you call it, not the profile one. So I just put text me on there. And what I'm doing is like, I like, I like to interact. I, I like to, when, you know, when I can, I'm a super busy person. So I'm always on the run, always all over the place. As a matter of fact, I just got home. I was in Florida and I like to interact. Why am I looking at the wall? Like camera. So I like to interact with people. So, so I started, um, I, I paid a good amount of money for like a, like a, like a secure type of thing for my phone here. So this way I, I don't get like uh, hacked or anything like that. Um, but I put my number out there and I've been texting. So it's all over the place. My number's everywhere. It's on, I have it on my Facebook page, um, Instagram, I have it all over there. And I'm like, what I do is when I get a minute, I sit down and I go through and I'm interacting with everybody. But I am closing it down soon because I wanted a certain amount of people in there so this way I can interact, okay? And it's almost already at that number, which just blows my mind. It just blows my mind away. And I like will send out messages to individuals and like just kind of inspire them, get them through the day. You know, like, uh, <clears throat> let me see here. Let me just say, I'll give you an example of what I sent out today. And it's a lot of work. It's definitely a lot of work. And I sit and I go through, you know, copy paste and I get to everybody. Um, where's that? Where's that? All right. So today I sent out a message. I know this is boring. Hold on. All right. So like a message I sent today to everybody, I said, being positive can be a habit just like any other habit, whether it's a bad habit or what. All right, so let me just read the damn thing. Being positive can be a habit, just like any other habit. If you do it enough, it becomes routine, which can lead to being happy. I'm serious, and I mean that. You know, so stuff like that. I want to, like, I don't know. I'm just so about helping other people. Like, some people say I'm, like, crazy. Like, you can't do that. But I really like to help other people. And whether I can or not, that's one thing. But that's just kind of what I'm doing, you know? And I'm going to do it until something tells me otherwise. You know what I'm saying? Come on, we need more people. 63 people in here. Come on, we got to get, we need up. We need more people. So I'm just going to, uh, yeah, I'm not going to just, I'm not going to say the number because I, I don't know how many people are on here. But if, if somebody is like sincere and passionate about what I'm doing, okay, and likes to hear from me time to time, you can either head over to my Instagram or my Facebook okay both of the banner pictures or whatever both of them have the phone number on there okay my number you can text me it's a simple thing once you once you do that it'll ask you like what your name you'll get a message right after 
from me and it says you know click you have to click on it put your name and all that and that that puts your name in my phone so I know who you are so if that's something you're interested in go ahead and do it you know what I mean um, but but I only want people that are sincere that that care about what I'm doing and vice versa so that that's where I'm at man I'm just like going on here and on and on and on Notice, yeah, you notice my number on Facebook text. Are you getting crazy things coming through? No crazy things at all. Um, all so far, it's been all genuine people, and I'm okay with that. Now I am, like I said earlier, I'm closing it down real soon. So if there's any sincere people that want to connect like that and hear from me, then go ahead and all you have to do is text the phone number, and then it'll, you know, that's it. But people that you know aren't in it for that, then don't don't bother. Don't bother because if somebody sends anything that's not um that you know that they shouldn't send or anything like that it's super simple i could just block them you know what i mean but um this is for this is about me connecting and helping people that's just what it's about and yes it's a crazy idea and i've set a number in my head and i know what i can do i know what i can do i know how many people i can connect with it's just more personal i don't know maybe i am crazy it's it's more personal okay all right all right all right, so I'm working on this piece, okay, right here for somebody, and yeah, I just figured I'd do a little live stream real quick while, while I'm doing some stuff, and I have a reference way like a mile off to my left here. Okay, yeah, so I put this thingy in here, and then I put some mist down here, and let me set that down real quick. <coughs> Hey, Steve. No, I know. Listen, I know exactly. It, it's funny. A lot of people will say like, hey, you know, I'm, I'm this person or that person. But there's something about me. When somebody emails me or tells me a story about themselves, like I will never forget who you are. That's that's one good trait that I have. I will never forget who you are. I just don't. I remember everybody. Don't ask me how. Should you be disappointed after four paintings? I'm not getting the results, I think. Absolutely not. Don't be disappointed. Do not be disappointed. Don't. Just don't. Because I, I did probably, I don't know, I can't even tell you. Anybody else on here will tell you the same thing. Don't get disappointed. That's early on in your, in your career, four paintings. All right. Thank you. Thank you for that. Love your art. Thanks for sharing. All right, so uh, this isn't really about painting. This is just about like talking, connecting, trying to answer a few questions. Come on, we gotta get some more people in here. It's starting to drop. It's starting to drop. Maybe I'll do something. Hold on. Let me just hop over here and let me do this real quick. Yeah. Take a picture of that, and then let's just use it, and live on YouTube. Boom, boom, and boom. So I'm gonna put some little uh, little bushes and stuff right in this area here. You know, something that's not too crazy. All right, let me get back to the screen here so I can see y'all. Paint for the fun of it, they get better later. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Tell him. Tell him that after four paintings, don't worry about it. You know, it's, it's not many paintings at all. Definitely shouldn't be worried after four paintings. All right. Let me slide my uh, phone out of the way here. And what color should I use? Yeah, so I want to just put some, like, bushes over here. So I want to get a nice, uh, all the yellows and, and, you know, a little bit of the green and stuff like that. I don't want to make them super bright yet or anything. But I wanted it to be, like, a green color, I guess. So we'll just have to see how this looks. Yeah, so this is a um, this is a painting that somebody requested. They they purchased it, so I gotta you know get this nice and done and send it on over. All right, so lights coming from here, you know. So I'll probably just make like little little bushy looking thingies. But 
But I'm not going to use too much paint on that because because I got to uh, I'm putting a nice beautiful big pine tree right there or somewhere around there. It's amazing what you can do with this little uh, with this little one-inch brush right here. Pretty cool. All right. You know just add little layers i don't know if you can see this but there's like these trees in the back and then there's like this lighter color right there it just serves as like a different layer i didn't get notified when you started this where are you now what happened nothing happened nothing happened um i didn't start this from the beginning i just said hmm i better turn it yeah let me just do a live this is kind of about talking really not about painting too much yeah painting but talking to and as far as getting notified yeah that's a serious problem because um, a lot of people do not get notified when I'm going on YouTube so that's the other reason I gave my phone number out so I can text interact you know I can send you know group messages and different things to people so I can tell them when I'm going live or I can tell them something that's coming up or something that I'm doing because I say this all the time, I'm so tired of the way Facebook works and Instagram. You know, you have, have 50,000 people following you and you know, 100 of them see what you're doing, it's horrible. At least I know that by text, everybody's gonna get it. And that be that. You know what else I love doing? <clears throat> I love putting like these little, like, See, little bright spots, little bright spots. It's just awesome to do that, by the way. All right, all right, let's see. Follow, oh man, our viewers are dropping. They're dropping. What is going on here? It's 5.30, is everybody working? Hmm, what name are you under Facebook? <coughs> Excuse me, all right. Okay, so it's the word, it's all, well, all one word. Paintings by Justin Wozniak. Paintings by Justin Wozniak. You'll see my little cartoon dude on the uh, yeah on the profile. He'll be on there. He'll be on there. All right, what am I even doing? I'm looking over. So I got to make yeah some stuff here, some land. But before I do that, let me just magnet that up real quick and get me. Fan brush. All right. Now remember, if you go anybody, I'm going to say this again. Like, this is about um, if anybody goes on my Facebook or Instagram, this is not like uh, you know if anybody starts like blowing me up or anything like that by text. I'm simply just going to block them just because I, I just can't put up. I can't do that because I have. I'm trying to do something nice here, and I think almost probably all of you probably understand that. I'm trying to do something nice. So like what I'm saying is when, when I have time to like sit down and like when everybody's looking at their phone or going through this or that, I can go through some messages and I can try to help people with certain things. You know what I mean? But definitely don't, don't want any craziness happening uh, because I definitely won't even reply to it. Just, just so you know that. And, and that's legit. You know, I'm sure people will understand that. You know, I don't want any craziness going on or yeah stuff like that. I, I just want to try to help some people adding some lighter color to this mist in here. I just want to genuinely be able to reach people, you know, send out some nice things to them and absolutely interact, you know, when I can. And I've done it already. There's probably people on here that, that have been talking to me, but you know, just don't let, don't be misunderstood um, by that. This is not uh, I don't want it to become inconvenient because I'll, I'll just shut it down. That's all. And, and the only reason I'm even like making that clear is because I don't have to explain it to you. There is like a lot of, uh, there's a lot of things that go on in this world. You know what I'm saying? That's all. Last name, it's, uh, wait a minute. Is there anybody on here that can just spell my name for me? Does anybody know paintings by Justin Wozniak? There's gotta be somebody. Just can you write that on one line for her? Please, I'd appreciate it. 
this way she can look at it and see where <clears throat> where to go. I'm gonna get another clean brush here real quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one looks good. You are welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Just follow the da da da. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Boom. Oh wow, there you go. Look at that. <laughs> Alright, so I put this lighter color in because I want it to be like I want it to be like even when you put in mist in a painting, like I put a base color of mist in. It's it's like a gray blue color, right? And then I just took a tiny bit of white and, and I came back. And then you like soften this up just a little bit, and man, does it really make a big difference. You know, and I'm not gonna really touch the top, it'll look like little baby water splashes and things. You know, and, and trust me, I am no expert, but I just want to try to share some stuff with you guys that'll help you. You know what I'm saying? That's the goal here. So pretty much this mist here, it's just like making a cloud. You know what I'm saying? It's like making a cloud at the bottom of the waterfall. I'm just getting a little bit more of this color here. I want to try to uh, make a couple little, sp maybe splash. This is like not super close, but I want to put little splashes in, see? And I'll, I'll soften these up too. Deck. And I'm doing this one nice because it's for somebody. I started with black gesso, yes. And I'm doing this one for somebody. Um, they, they purchased it, well, you know, they purchased this painting. This was $400. And asked me if I could, this was, they saw another one that they liked and made a few little requests, nothing crazy. And I said, yes, absolutely, I can do that. So here I am today. Making this, so this way it can dry and I can ship it out and all that stuff because I'm leaving again. I got another trip I have to go on. I just saw you on Twitter also. This, that is that, wait a minute. This I can follow you on because I don't have Facebook or Instagram. I will go at that oh, follow button, man. Show hi. Okay, cool. Yeah, so he, so Steve here, Steve just, I don't know if that's a link, but I think it looks like a link to my Twitter. I am starting Twitter just because it's the right thing to do. It's like a more professional platform. And I always didn't like Twitter, but I am going on Twitter. I will say this real quick. Um, on Twitter, if you use the little at symbol, the little A with whatever the circle around it, uh, if you want to find me on there, it's paintings, Justin. That's it. The word paintings and the word Justin, all, all in one, that's how you find me. They didn't have paintings by Justin on there, so I had to stick with paintings, Justin. A little late to the show. Everybody took it. Somebody took it. All right, all right. Thank you. I am not an expert. Not an expert. I try though. I try. So I want to put some, uh, I got to figure this out because I want to put land in here, right? I want to put land in here. So I think I'm going to do, I want to make this one a little bit more interesting than the other. <clears throat> we got to get more viewers in here. Come on, help me out. So I'm just going to take, I got this little filbert with a little bit of color on it. And I wanted to do something like I wanted to come here and I wanted to go this way and I wanted to go that way. All right. So I just want it to be like a little lake, not a lake, like a stream, right? And it goes right off the canvas like that. Maybe I can make it just a hair wider, use a little bit lighter color. Because remember, I got to put a tree right here. So this goes this way like this and it swoops down. Oh yeah, I like that. See that? Now this will be our, that's where the water is crashing down and stuff. And then our land will be, I think I'm gonna make it look like a hill drop. I love hills. I love it. Something like this. And I always do these little sketches because man, are they effective. See, see this looks like a hill. It's just like a hill. I mean, you, may not, you might not even be able to see what I'm doing. I don't know. Let me step back. Yeah, cool. So I can put my big old tree here, right there, or maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll do it here. This looks like a better place, actually, to put that. I 
not being any distractions. It's amazing how you can talk and look at the screen. Yeah, trust me, I'm always I'm distracted when I'm sleeping. You know what I mean? But you just you just roll with it. I'm like a I'm a very high strung individual. Very high strung. Very positively high strung individual. I don't know, I just gotta say something. You know, the last time we had over like two or three hundred people watching, there's only sixty, and I, and I want more in here because I want more people to see this. Just a little disclaimer. <clears throat> the last video, not the last one, the one before that, the video that I made about me, you know me going back to a place where like I legitimately tried to end my life. Like I had a lot of messages after that, and I just want to make sure everybody knows. Like, yeah, I'm totally good. I'm fine. I'm perfect. I thought it would be powerful to share that with some people. That's all. I'm good. 100%. 100%. All right, so we got some dark color in here, but I'm going to add some, like, some, you know, I got to add something in here, some greenish look or whatever. Kind of see where I'm going with this. So I'm going to just take some, uh, some green, a little bit of black, and some blue. Even though I use black gesso and the dark color is there. Still got to put color in. Yeah, see, you're not going to be able to see this, but I am. You know, just because you want to, when I highlight this color, some of this green will come out. So you want that. Powerful video. Powerful. Thank you. I wanted it to be powerful, you know? Like, it's hard, it's hard to make it. I, I'm not going to... I'm not going to say, like, it's not. It was hard to make that because, you know, people that are watching can probably, you know, get some. I tried. But look, when I make a video like that, I put a lot into it, you know. I really do. That's why you'll see the overhead shots of me driving. I did all of that video, all of it, everything, the stuff that was from overhead, all the beautiful lake shots, everything. Because I want people, I want people to get that feeling not the depressed feeling, but I want them to sort of feel what I was feeling at the moment. If that didn't just contradict itself. So, yeah. That's what I wanted. And, hope, you know, I hope people understood. But I'm good. I'm, you know, I'm definitely good. I did that because I was ready to do that. I wanted to go, you know, because I've honestly had dreams about that in the past. And I would, like, wake up and I would be like, I would feel like disturbed in the middle of the night. I would wake up and just be like, oh wow, did that just really happen? So I kept telling myself for months now, like I have to go there. I, I just have to go there and that's it. And I did, and I went there and I took you with me. I took you right with me. See these little things I do? Like, I don't know what this is, but I can guarantee you somebody will be like, oh wow, look at the detail on that little thing just stabbing it with a filbert. It just breaks up that little line, that little straight line or whatever. And it looks like something. Man, you guys, these messages are so cool. These comments are so cool. I, you know, that's another reason why uh, I like connecting with people. Because you just don't know, man. Like, you don't know who who you can change in a positive way, you just never know. And to me, it's like, why wouldn't you? You know what I mean? You know, there's so many people, whether it's YouTube or Facebook or Instagram, I'll bet you there's, well, I know this personally, there's so many people that when you like reach out to them, they just, I don't know if they don't care or they just don't read anything, but they'll never get back to you. And man, did I used to hate hearing that. You know, when nobody wants to get back to you and it's like, you send this nice message to somebody and you don't hear anything. And how does that make you feel? I don't even have to ask you because you know. So I, that's why I try my best. Of course I miss stuff. Intentionally, not a chance. That's why I'm trying to offer so many different ways to contact. And I'll tell you this too, like, you know, the taxi thing is great, but if somebody has like a legitimately serious long, long thing that they want to send me that it's personal, which I get every day, and I read every one of them, 
definitely please email that to me. It's just, it's much easier by email when it comes to that. Like if you're trying to share a story with me, email it over. Now I'm softening this up because I just don't want it to be like sticking right out in your face, you know, but I just want something going on here. And I'm, just, I'm just tapping this with a filbert brush. I don't really, you know, and I don't know if you can see that, but it's like, it's cool because it just looks like this cool foliage and stuff, you know. Absolutely, man. Steve, 100%, man. Yeah, man, let's do it. Let's do it. Coffee. I drink coffee all day, all night. I know this is bad. I'm going to catch some hell for this, but I probably drink like 15 or 20 cups of coffee a day. Seriously. No, that's not even a joke. Not even a joke. I think we should get some uh, yellow ochre and just let's try a touch of this little red. That'll spice it up, right? And maybe some green, just to dull it. So many forms of contact can be overwhelming. I'm down to only YouTube and Instagram. Instagram will go this year. I hear you, man. I, you know, I agree with you, but just like I said earlier, people call me crazy for a reason, and I am. I just <clears throat> the reason I do it is because I, I'm like, this is my thought. I'll just tell you what my thought is. I think about this all the time. I think about there's. What about that one person, right? That one person that just wants to end everything or is, is just totally having a bad life and everything. You know, to come across a video like that or, or see something that says, text me, you know? Maybe that can make a difference in this world. We live in a bad world, you know? Um, and I'm sure you guys know that. And I'm just, I don't know. If it, I don't wanna say it's inconveniencing to me, but if I could make a small difference in this world while I'm here alive. I want to do it because, man, I wish somebody was there for me to make a difference when I was when I was struggling. It would have meant the world to me. You know what I'm saying? What town and state am I in? I am in Browns Mills, New Jersey. Browns Mills, New Jersey. Oh, thank you there, Mr. Sullivan. Sullivan. Sullivan, Boston, right? Tell me, are you from Connecticut or Boston? Boston has been one of my favorite cities ever in my life. And I'm going to go there for sure. I'm going to do, do a class there or something for all the Bostonians. Because I love it. Now, if you'll notice, you see, I'm really not... I'm not rushing through this, right? And why, you're probably wondering why. Because, listen, when somebody, when somebody contacts me and they want a painting, I don't rush through it at all. I'll take my time and make sure that it's got all these extra elements and things in it so it's a you know, good experience. You know, I want it to brighten the room up wherever it goes. You see how I'm putting some of this color in the area of the green too? So this way you don't just have, you know, some green stuff and then yellow ochre stuff. It's like kind of mixed, sort of. But I'm not worried about these little details or, or I say, I guess some of you would consider this a detail. I'm just smashing with the filbert brush, you know what I'm saying? In my RV in Texas until the class is in Indiana. All right, there you go. That's gonna be pretty cool, I think, man. I really do. And uh, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be there all four days. As, as long as nothing comes up. As long as nothing I, I really planned bad the last time. All right. Let's see here. Let's, uh, let's figure this out. Just making a little lighter line here for my sketches. Lighter line for my uh, ground, I mean. I want that to pop down like that. Okay. Now... I'm probably going to use, uh, hmm, yeah, that dirty one-inch brush over here. I'm not going to go through the whole thing, like the whole thing. I don't, I want it to be, when it's done, I want, like, I don't want it to be on the internet until the people get it. So I'm going to do a little, yeah, a little bit more. Yep, phone's ringing. 
Sorry, in the middle of a stream right now. I will get back to you. All right. Hmm. Let's do, all right, I'm going to start off with a darker green. So I'm going to just mix some green and yellow. Now when you're, when you're adding like grass to something, like you see this is dark. So when you put your, when you start putting grass in, I would suggest using a, not a super light color, use a darker color and then build your way up. You get more, it just looks better that way. Why do you put the cameras on before you start? Why? Oh, what? what? Black gesso. And I let it dry. All right, so I got me a fairly, let me get some yellow over. This should be a, uh, <clears throat> a darker green color. It might appear lighter because of the dark that's already on here. You know, so I'm going to leave a little space and I'm going to work just slowly like this. And we'll go boom, right up to there, just like that. I know this might look light-ish, but it's uh, it's the darker of the color. All right, I'm gonna run right over to here. This is a, uh, a little bit lighter, I suppose. Okay, start forming my area here. All right, and I know for a fact, like this here is going to start there, and I actually want this to go. I want this to kind of run like a hill this way. All right. And then I'll start working with this in a minute. This is just like a outline of what I'm doing. You know, it's cool that you can like, you can jump from one thing to the next and back to the first or whatever. Same thing here. I want to leave a little, you know, leave a little bit of a dark spot. All right. made my little sketch lines and this is how you get like a little hill going on you turn the brush you know you just turn it I want this dropping straight down see you see it's coming down now this is just the first color but it'll give you the idea you got to have uh, it's got to be water you don't want it spilling out or whatever so the hills are Dropping down the water is in between it. A little bit there, not too much. I want this to go right to the water. Right. I'm just tapping super light, doing a few things here. Yeah. All right. I haven't done anything with the water yet. Nothing. Nada. Nothing at all. Keep on the sunny side of life and keep on painting. You are creative and amazing. Thank you very much there, Valerie. Appreciate that. I, I try. So I always love doing this. I love wiping it off on a paper towel. You know, I mean, nobody needs to be smacking paint thinner around, you know, in this day and age. I mean, it's dangerous stuff. All right, so light is here. It's kind of like whoop, going this way. All right. So now I'll get a little bit of a brighter color. Not super bright yet. Maybe that'll be the last one. I'm just tapping my, uh, I'm just getting some color on here on my uh, brush. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Got some color on here. I'm thinking about light and I'm thinking about light only. Where is it going? So I know it's dropping here because we have some on that rock or whatever that is. All right, so, so we have some here. Maybe it goes there. Maybe the edge of that catches it, you see? <clears throat> Tap some more. And it's gonna catch here on this hill. See? And I'm turning it just like I was, you know, putting the original color on, all right? So it, it just kind of defines that hill. That it really does. And it works, it's so effective if you do it the right way. Now, I could easily overdo this, but I don't want to do that. All right, so I want to, all right, run it into that area like that. Don't 
hover, do this, or whatever you do. A little bit there, maybe a little push there. See? And that's not the brightest color yet. I am going to put a little bit over here, too. A little bit of light's coming around here. So look, let's drop it in here. See? Don't overdo it. You'll you still see the green in there, but you see the lights kind of shining down. All right. All right now, let me wipe this off. All right. So now is when I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to put a bright color in, a little bit of a brighter color, and that's even less than what I did here. Definitely going to get some moderators too, by the way. So, um, in my next, keep a lookout. Keep a lookout. I'm going to, I'll do like a community post on YouTube. So, don't send me any questions about it or whatever, because I'll do a post on there and I'm going to select, like, if anybody wants to be, moderate the comments when I'm doing the live streams, I will reach out um, on a post for that, okay? So, just keep, keep an eye out for that. I'm just softening the edge here real quick. All right, now, bright color time. All right, so I'm gonna pull a little bit of yellow and hit that over here, and then a little bit of white. This is one of my favorite parts, yellow and white. All right, here we go, here we go. <clears throat> to everybody that didn't get to see this part because they're not watching, sorry, but here we go. Right about, now this is, don't overdo this because you will not be happy. I want, okay, I'm going back down into the paint, watch this. Magic, literally. Light shining there. <laughs> See, you see what I'm talking about right there? It's just kind of like, boom, like, hello, where did you come from? Okay. Love it. I love it. Now, did anybody else, can anybody else see what that did? I'm trying to watch here. Oh, wow, I can, I'm watching the screen, like what's wrong with me? Now, what I'll do is this. <clears throat> I just wiped my brush off. There's really no paint on there. And then I just like, uh, sort of like feather the edge out. And the only thing that this does, is I don't ever hit the top of this paint. I just feather it just a hair. And what does it do? It just kind of really it just sets it right into place. You see? Mm -hmm. Nice. I like that. Fan brush time. Fan brush. All right. Um, now, I, I did, all right, quick uh, little disclaimer. I did put black gesso on here, I let it dry, and then I used uh, Prussian blue paint, Prussian blue, very, very small amount, whipped it across the canvas. All right, now let me get the fan brush and some white. Fan brush and some white. Actually, I'm gonna use the one inch and a tiny bit of white. Let me see here, I gotta get some color in this water, just a little bit, so I'm gonna I don't want it to be super bright yet, so I'm going to drop down just a little bit, see? Just a little tiny bit. It could have been a good idea to do this before I did the grass, but I'll survive. You see how I'm leaving some dark in here too? I mean. This stuff right here, pretty standard. Everybody probably is well aware of the old pull-down method. Very effective. 
on a black canvas and then swiping it sideways. Very, very effective. Super effective. Just softening this up. All right, and that's just like a base color for the uh, the water. You know what I'm saying? Just the base color. Okay, now back to the uh, fan brush here. We are losing, well, we are losing watchers, viewers. I don't care. I'm real big on that. I'm real big on people watching and viewing stuff because. Call me crazy, but I think uh, I think I have like some kind of message to get out there to people. I don't even charge anything for doing it. I'm doing it for free. You know what I'm saying? What do I want to do? I'm thinking something here. Let me try this. Let's just make a little. I don't know. I'll see how that looks later. lines in here and you could soften always soften these up super easy all right because uh, let's see here yeah so that's the I don't know what I'm trying to say can anybody tell me I'm just kidding so now you put the paint down right you put it down that's not the final product is what I was saying I just put the color down and then I want to soften it more it's just another layer to this lake or water or whatever this thing is, a river or stream. That's all that is. It's just another layer of stuff. You know, some of it shows through, some of it may not. But the last little layer that I put on, you know, will be great. Worst case scenario, you have to go back in here, take your uh, one inch brush, right? And then kind of fix this guy up here. That's all. See? Put a little bush back on him or whatever. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. All right, all right. Howdy, Mrs. Yovette. How are you? Love your videos, by the way. I watch all of them. I, I don't know if I ever told you that. I love it. Love the little series you're doing with the cabins and things. You know, hopefully everybody, you know, heads over there and check her. You guys think I'm good. You have to go see uh, Mrs. Yovette here. She's, trust me, much better than I'll ever be, so... Head over and check her out. She's got some very, very good informational videos. And uh, go see for yourself. Don't, don't take my word for it. There's so many good people here on YouTube. So many good people. Amazing. Just such a great community. You know what I mean? People that care and all that stuff. It's just, I love it. I really do. Um, you know, I'm looking up here and I like the darkness going on, but I think uh, let's, let's bring a little bit of I think we should bring a little bit of color into this dude's life up here. These trees. I'm going to get some some green. I'm not super bright though. Not super bright. Just some green and yellow, a little bit of ochre, red, you know, all those good things. <clears throat> Let me see here. So the, the light is in here. So so this is going to be kind of diffused because you know, it's not supposed to be real close. Oh, this is giving it a cool little look. And forgive me if I say things that don't make sense or don't finish my sentences. I'm only human. <clears throat> yeah. All right. I can diffuse that even a little bit more. I just wanted to have a little bit of uh, color. Right? Lights this way. brush and then I got a clean, somewhat of a clean brush here soften some of it up so I'm just kind of tapping on it you can, I guess you can lift it too right hmm, seems to work I like tapping it just gives it a whole other look let's see here yeah Hmm. 
these magnets on the easel are a must have. I don't even know if you can see them. Totally must have them. Testing, testing. What are you testing, Steve? <laughs> testing, testing. It's five o'clock somewhere. It's six here. <laughs> You're very welcome for everything, uh, Steve. Definitely, man. Thank you for always watching everything, leaving such good uh, <whistles> feedback and comments and stuff. Man, I'm, you just. All right, so if you ever get worried, you just got to do it. I got to drop me a little trunk in, right? And I want this to be big. I'm going to put it right about there. Oh, yeah. Ruin the little guy. It's all right. He's still there. I don't want much of this to show through. I just wanted a, an idea. All right. All right. Okay. Let's see here. Hang on a second. Let me, I have to block somebody. Somebody wrote something very nasty. Hold on one second, guys. Hide user on this channel. First, let me report them. Sexually explicit material. Thanks for receiving your report. And we, yes, all right. All right. All right. You see how easy that is? Life is easy. Some Now, you guys didn't see this, but somebody wrote like nine comments in a row, in a row, and they were very, very nasty comments. Very Not about me or anything, but they were referring to other people's wives. Yeah. So I just reported and blocked them. Super easy. Life is easy. Let's get back to the tree. Oh, uh, yeah. No, I do, man. I block. I'll, it's so easy to block. I mean, you know, why am I going to let, you know, something get in my way or whatever? You know what I'm saying? I try to look at the bigger picture. I mean, I am human, you know, but I love the block feature. It's just so convenient. And I've done it a lot. Of, I mean, I've blocked a lot of people. And you just have to. I mean, if it's for your own, well you know, well-being, you got to do it. You just have to do it. All right, I need to be about six inches taller. Now, this, this color here is not really going to, you're probably not going to see this too good. I can see it. I know, like, what I have to do with it. <clears throat> but it's when the, uh, when the lighter color comes on is you know, that's when it's going to be super visible. Now, I'm probably going to let this, uh, because this is black and brown and blue, the color, I'm going to probably let it sit overnight. It's going to really tack up. <clears throat> brown is the first color to dry with oil paint. And then, like, blue is sort of right behind that, and you're black. So I want to, you know, just get the, I guess this is like the under, the dark part of the tree. And... Be able to put some light back on it. Now another thing, even though you guys can't see this too good, but I'm putting the limbs in for this tree, right? And you see this rock right here? It's totally cool to, to go, go a little bit over the rock because that's going to tell you, number one, it's going to tell you that that tree is definitely, you know, in front. Don't be afraid though. You see, don't be afraid to like think you have to go up to the edge here and stop. Plow right over it. It, it totally works. So I'm just taking my time, skipping a spot. And like I said, this is just the dark color, super boring. And I keep reloading. That's another thing too. 
make sure you have enough, like, make sure you're using enough paint when you're making something, you know? Don't let it, uh, you know, don't, like, let it grind into the canvas or whatever, and then smear the layer behind it or whatever. So I would say this to people in the class is, like, more paint, less of a touch. And that seems to work. Just my opinion. And now watch this, you might be able to see this because there's some mist here. So I'm going to bring this limb right out like that. See? Right into the misty area. And I'll have a little, for the one that hangs down. You totally can't see that, trust me. No worries though. Because tomorrow, I'm going to put some light color on that. Let me get this. To yeah. I'll give you a preview. How's that? Fair enough? Fair enough preview. Okay, here we go. All right, so. So tomorrow when I come in, like if I was to do this right now, I just don't want to because I, I want it to be super nice for the gentleman who, uh, who got the, bought this. All right, so I'll take my fan brush when I come in here. Lights on this side. And I would slowly, slowly more paint right more paint less touch and this is a lot of wet paint on here right and I would go right over top right literally right over top of the wet paint that's already on here because I'm using more you see what I'm saying here and this wouldn't this it wouldn't be the brightest color either this is the like a mid-tone and then I would come back lighter and lighter and lighter and just kind of see I'll do one here just kind of bring the tree to life. You see the limbs that are starting to appear? Like, look at this here. But you see how I keep reloading, right? I keep reloading and I'm trying to hit the top of this, uh, this top of this limb right here. See that? And I'm, I am leaving some dark in. I hope this makes sense trying to show you. You see, the tree will start to come to life. And look at me. I'm sitting here like, I'm not doing this today. I'm going to do it tomorrow. And <laughs> I'm almost done. I mean, might as well just do it for a minute. Might as well do this part. Miss Diana Mulliken. Mulliken, I think I said that right. Thank you for the super chat, which if anybody wants to know, super chat is when people donate money during live streams for people that are just trying to do the right thing. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. I, I really do. I never ask anybody for anything, but I absolutely love when I do live streams and people, when people donate because it just helps with what I'm doing. I mean, that's just what it is. So that's way I can explain that. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and maybe one day... I don't know, I'll be able to do so much more. It just depends on the world, you know? It just depends on the world. I do, um, and I'll just throw, I'll just say it. I do so many things for free that I limit myself. So if I, if I was able, I don't know. If like I never had to worry about money in my life, you guys would just be blown away with what I would, with, with what I would do in this lifetime. But I'm, limit, I'm limited in life, so I'm not complaining. So... There's so many things I want to do. Oh my goodness. I don't, even, don't get me started. Don't get me started. Light touch. Look, right over the rock. Beautiful little branch. See that? Right. But do you see, like, what I'm doing here? Like, this is not. This is not one of them trees that you make in just like a minute. I'm taking my time because number one, I have um, I have so much paint underneath of here already. I have so much paint, and I'm just uh, taking my time. Nice little limb in the front there, and then. You come, let me try to do one area. I really shouldn't do this whole thing. I really can't. Let 
I'm gonna wipe this fan brush off and just give you an example real quick. Let me grab some of my yellow into this pile with some, yeah. I need more yellow, touch of green, just so it's not eye piercing. All right, here we go. All right, just a demonstration. So I got more paint on the fan brush. It's, it's a much lighter, much lighter color, right? So once again, you think about where light is, okay? Think about the light. It's going to be, in this case, on the left side. This is a time-consuming tree. I mean, that's, that's for sure. A little bit up here. Hmm. Decisions. You see what I'm doing? I'm, I'm reloading. I'm, I'm trying not to put too, too much because I don't want to kill the color that I put underneath. But you're going to eventually see a tree come together here, is what, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Costello. Thank you, my good sir. I appreciate it. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me wipe this wipe this off real quick. I want to try something. Let me get... I'm going to get a darker green color, okay? This is just a... yeah. Mm, touch of black, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it looks. Darker green color. I want to try to see... Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't want to do too much of this because I want to leave it dark. You may not see this, but this is a darker color, and this kind of com will complete the other side of this tree, sort of. A little branch here and there. Thank you. And once I get all that together and add little thingies here and there, just different things, I guess, I could probably use some yellow over. Mix it up, spice it up a little bit. Yellow ochre right there, maybe. The branch there, there. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, so it's like, it's a tree, you know? No doubt, it's a tree. Mm -hmm. And you know how I roll. Like, I want to do something real quick, but I got a dirty fan brush with green on it. Do not let that stop you because I am easily just going to go into the pile of white with a touch of brown on it, okay? Pile of white, touch of brown. You saw that dirty, very dirty brush, right? And I just want to put in a little bit of something right there. You know, watch, I'm going to wipe that back off. No need to switch brushes, I mean, on almost anything. Who cares? Don't switch. Just get it done. I'm going to pull this. Pulling it to the right. Now, into the black, same thing, boom, give it some depth, okay? Give it a little shadow, sound effects, mm-hmm, we'll just get a little brown while we're in here, just a little brown to bring it to life. A little bit, and there we have a little branch trunk, the thing that's holding this tree up. You know what I'm saying? Ruby raindrops. Thank you very much for the super chat. I, I, I wish I could just, show. yeah. I, I appreciate everything. I, I do, and I'll say that until the day I'm not breathing anymore. I appreciate everything. I really, really do. One of these days, I'm going to be able to do everything that I want to do with zero constraints, and it's just going to really. It's really going to make such a difference. I have so many plans. I really have so many plans. Oh my Lord. And I have so many projects. I, some of them I can't even talk about. Some of them I've already done. Can't wait to show you guys. So cool. So many good things. All right. Looking down here at some questions. All right. You guys are great. You guys are so cool. So awesome. Here's what I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling a little bit of yellow ochre 
into the mix. How about you? Let's do it. Let's do it. A little yellow ochre. Spice this thing up just a hair. Mm. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice. says we need just one color. Add all kinds of depth into this thing today. Mm -hmm. Just using a little fan brush. Making these little cool little push pushy uppy things. Mm -hmm. What do you think? What do you think? If you think this is good, why don't everybody just drop a quick thumbs up maybe or something or, you know, whatever you're feeling. A lot of emoji marks. Tell me what you think. I mean, the, you know, the yellow ochre I just put in. Remember, I had that one color. I just had yellow, then I went to a brighter yellow, and then I just added some yellow ochre in. I think, uh, I really think it helps with the depth, you know. I don't know what else to say. All right, got some thumbs up coming. I like it. I like it. This is good. Good stuff right here. Very good stuff. bush here. See? Just use what you got. A little layer right there. Mm -hmm. Alright, look at all these thumbs up. You guys are cool. You guys are awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, okay. Alright, now. Just wiping the old fan brush off right quickly. <laughs> and another thing uh, that I'm sincerely, seriously thinking about doing, check this out, hear me out on this one, while I'm grabbing my palette knife with some super bright color, let me just get the color first, yellow, ochre, and white, and then there's all kinds of little blue in there, a little bit of everything, I guess. All right. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking about doing. Thoughts. This is just, you know, I'm a thinker, right? I think a lot about stuff. First of all, look at this. Oh, yeah, look at that. If this doesn't brighten your day up right here, I don't know what will. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, perfect. I get so into this, it's crazy. See, I just added some bright onto there. Just come in here, speak a little bit right there. Scrape it in, whatever. Um, so I've been I've been bouncing back and forth with the idea of planning a trip, right? I'm when I was gonna plan a trip. All right, just hear me out. Hear me out. I want to plan a trip with. 15 people, right? 15 people. Like, I'll have it all arranged. There's like a set fee. There's like a set amount that you would have to pay. And it would be either in the country or out of the country. Like, we would go on uh, sort of like a retreat type of thing, right? We would go somewhere beautiful. We would do, you know, walking or touring or hiking or, you know, painting is the main thing. We'd be painting, but, you know, scuba diving, just like sightseeing, exploring, maybe hiking up a mountain. Not, not, not hiking up a mountain. You get the point. So I was going to do something like that. I was going to limit it, limit it to 15 or 20 people. Obviously, plan very good ahead of time, and just roll with it. Like, and do maybe one. That's it. Like, I wouldn't do any more. But like a painting type of retreat, maybe out of the country. I don't know. In the country, out. Of, I don't know. One of these national parks or somewhere. Just somewhere perfectly beautiful. I was going to plan it, and I can guarantee you, it would be the best time of your life that that week. Tell me your thoughts. You know, obviously it's not like something that's super cheap, but um, I, I can promise you one thing. It would be a lifetime, like once in a lifetime experience. Seriously. So, yeah, that's something that I, I have in the works. And uh, what else can I say? Everybody will know about it as soon as I do. But everybody would obviously have to travel, is what my point is. Like, it would be a set location. And everything would be just, it would just be so amazing. And I have a lot of contacts across the country uh, for like different facilities and different things that I could use. 
you know, for something like that, but I would want this to be like epic, completely epic. Yeah, all that. I'm a dreamer. I'm a dreamer. Well, it's not really a dream, it's like a reality. I just gotta make it come into play, you know what I'm saying? I need some blue and white. That actually looks a little green, but I'm okay with it. Not too worried here. Uh, it's brown, let's put some brown in it, it'll gray it. That's what I'm looking for. More brown. But could you imagine, seriously, like could you imagine like, you know, going somewhere for like three days or something like that, like just totally amazing type of trip, like, um, I don't know, like I said, I don't know, like snow, uh, swimming with a like doll, I, you get the point, right? You get what I'm saying? I don't know exactly what it would be. It would be something cool though. Memorable. You know? I don't want to say like skydiving or anything like that because I don't know, but you know, you get up early in the morning, you like, you walk down a beautiful trail at some, you know, wherever we're at, like a resort or whatever, you watch the sunrise, you know, drink coffee. I mean, more than drink coffee, you get it. It's gonna happen, it's definitely gonna happen. And I can tell you right now, like, I will, uh, soon as I like come up with everything, soon as I post that with all the details, with, the, with those spots, like it'll be gone and probably, I'd say at one day, everybody will be signed up because it's just something that I don't know that I'll, I would ever do it again, but it's something I want to do. It's like a bucket list type of an item, for me at least. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'm going to, I'm just going to use the point of my knife, I suppose, here. Let's see how this works out for me. I just want to see if I can. You're not. You're not going to be able to see this. Uh, see it, but, but I do want to make some marks in here before I, before this tacks up tonight. This will just be little extra little details and stuff. <clears throat> So much cool this year. You don't have to rush through every painting. You know, I've repeatedly tried to tell myself that, like, you know, don't rush, don't rush, don't rush. Take your time. I'm just wondering, if the lights shine in here, mm -hmm. see, this is where you gotta be careful. I feel like, I feel like there should be something here. You know, just a little something. Not too much. And something here too. <clears throat> These are just like the little details that they really make a difference, you know what I'm saying? They like really do make a difference. I definitely don't want to like ruin the whole surprise like but I thought it was cool you know to do a little a little bit of this live you know I hope you guys like everything that we're uh that we're doing here uh what else what else yeah you know like I said I'm gonna I have to check but I I, I think I got like 300 messages while I was uh doing a little live stream so I have to check I'm gonna close down the text thing soon I just like I said I wanted to get the sincere people in there that you know the sincere, passionate people that are passionate about what I'm doing. Same thing, I'm passionate about them. and they're, I'm passionate about everybody's life. I mean, who am I kidding? Um, just a different way to connect and, and just be hopeful because every day that I wake up, I'm hopeful. I live full of hope. 
that's just how I live, and I think everybody should live that way. I think you all should live, just wake up and be hopeful. I said it earlier today. Be positive. Like, people have so many bad habits. Wake up and force yourself to be positive. Do it for a couple of weeks. It'll become a habit, you know? That's, that's something that actually happened to myself. So, talking from experience. So I think, um, I think I'm probably going to leave the live stream up. You want to give me a quick thumbs up? I think most people like to go back and watch. Um, let me know if I should do that because I never, I never know if I should leave them up and I've taken some of them down. So um, maybe I should leave this one up for everybody. So, so we will see. Yeah, super excited. I'm talking about this big trip, going somewhere. Yeah, climbing up epic mountains and maybe skiing or skydiving or snowboarding. I'm not crazy, but I'm telling you, we're going to do it. We're going to do that. 15 or 20 of us, maximum. It's coming. Trust me. It's coming. All right. I can't edit this, so I better shut up and stop talking. 6.33 Eastern Standard Time. All right, cool. Thanks for watching. You guys are great. I love all you guys. You guys know that. I tell you in every video. And um, hmm. I guess I'll see you soon. Take care. God bless. Have a great day. What do you think? Definitely not done. I'm going to finish this. It's going to be super nice. I'll post it when I'm done. I hope the people are happy. Every time somebody orders a painting or a commission, I really do take my time and I, I really put my heart, I put my heart into every painting, but these I put a little extra time into. So. Okay. All right. Let me go around the back and end this live stream. Peace out. Take care. God bless you.